Hello there. Please come in, have a seat. <laughs> Welcome to the Gossamer Falls Private Eye. Well, we're a bit more of a professional detective agency, but uh, couldn't quite think of a catchy name, so I just went with the obvious. <laughs> so, uh, what can I do for you today? Ah, I see. So you've been referred. You know, I uh, think I might already have a case going on you. Uh, let me check my files. Let's see here. Oh, that's not that one. This one. Hmm. Ah, here we go. I thought so. I only mention this because I did recognize you from the pictures I have in the file. Some, uh, well, some surveillance photos of you around the village. Oh, oh, don't, don't get alarmed. It's fine. Uh, nothing compromising. And, uh, hmm, this is quite strange. Hmm. Well, before I go into this, uh, why in particular are, are you uh, paying us a visit today? Hmm. Oh, I see. A benefactor. Hmm. hmm. Well, that is really. Rather peculiar, isn't it? So, you say they're pretty much covering all the expenses for you, hmm? All right. Well, um... I think, yes, please make yourself comfortable. I think this is going to come as a bit of a shock. Uh, let me just sort through the notes for a minute to try to get my head around it. Is that all right? do you know about your life before you arrived here in Gossamer Falls? Mm -hmm. I see. So you remember bits and pieces, but not quite a memory go back, may I ask? Well, that makes sense with uh, the notes I have here. H how familiar are you with um, magical enchantment, spells, curses, things of that nature? All right, then. Oh, let me take a drink first. I'm sorry. I just had a lot to take in. Would you like anything? Some tea? I'll have Maggie uh, whip some up for you. How do you take it? Okay. Maggie, can you get our client uh, a tea, please? Thank you. Okay. I'm trying to get piece together all the facts here. It, it is a little bit muddled. Um, but from what I gather, um, I've had a team out for quite some time doing some research. And, um, well, the benefactor is actually you. <laughs> uh, hmm. <laughs> you see, You came into our agency many years ago and uh, requested that we 
hold an ongoing file on you should you ever turn up in Gossamer Falls again. Shortly thereafter, we sent one of our agents out to speak with you, and you were nowhere to be found. In fact, we did a little bit of a search, and then realized you probably didn't want to be found, so we gave up the ghost, so to speak. Stopped uh, looking. The notes here. In fact, the things got even more odd when uh, a couple days later our agents forgot about you altogether. It looks like the file was just completely dropped and stored away in our cabinet here. The only thing I can gather is that there was some sort of spell used, um, an enchantment of sorts that wiped you out of everyone's memory. Yes. Hmm. When you turned up again, um, apparently someone's memory was jogged. Mm, yes. Agent Crabapple. Mm -hmm. Well, he's always been more intuitive than most of us. Um, it says here that he kept things a little close to the hip, didn't mention anything to anyone else, and uh, did some light questioning around the town, and no one had any recollection of you whatsoever. But he remembered you vaguely. It says in his notes here that um, you triggered something that he'd forgotten long ago. It's kind of an odd statement. Huh. I have no recollection of you, but as I said, Crabapple, he's unique. I think his family has many magical lineage, um, which on his mother's side great grandma, something like that. I've seen this once before. A client, a year or two ago, uh, requested that her memory be completely erased and then everyone who ever knew her or came into contact with her, acquaintances, people who passed her by in the street, everyone. And we just slipped something into the water, essentially, that uh, made everyone immediately forget she ever existed. She wanted to disappear, you see. It was something to do with family troubles, I believe. I didn't drink the water for quite some time. I just went with bottled, <laughs> showered and filtered. Because I uh, need to know everything possibly can. I'm sort of the, uh, the town uh, record keeper. In terms of memories, anyway. But you, you were before my time, weren't you? Hmm. I'm just curious why you wanted this to happen. And it would make sense if your memory stops about five years back. It's around about the time these files are dated. From what I can gather, it looks like you set up an intricate plan to well, provide for yourself when you did return. But I wonder why you returned in the first place. More importantly, why you disappeared in the first place. And why you went to such great lengths to have everyone think you vanished into thin air. Well, more so completely 
non-existent in the first place. Hmm. I'm going to dig into this a little bit more for you. See if I can jog in one's memory. But in the meantime, I'm going to give you the name of someone I think you should see. In fact, apparently you recommended that you see her when you returned. There's a card here for her. I'll give you all of her information. Something tells me that she knows a bit more than the rest of us. I know this must all come as a shock. You probably thought it was some long lost relative or maybe some romantic uh, prospect. I don't know. But I think this is so much more interesting, don't you? Uh, so many questions. But absolutely no answers. Yet. Yet, my friend. We'll find them. We'll get to the bottom of this mystery. I just wonder what's lurking in your past. Hmm. Well, I but um, if you have any information in the meantime, please stop in and let me know. Um, the directions were quite explicit that you go and visit this particular individual. You might have the information for us, so I won't trouble her, but I do recommend you go see her as soon as possible. See what she has to tell you. Hopefully it's something juicy. Hmm? <laughs> hmm. But not too dangerous. Let's hope for all of our sakes. I don't think I can handle too much more adventure <laughs> at my age. All right, then. You take care. And if there's any sign of trouble, you call the local authorities as soon as possible and get in touch with me. We don't want to be messing with anything too untoward, do we? All right. I'm actually going to give you this uh, information I have in the file. It's all in duplicate, so I'll give you a copy. You can kind of peruse it. It's basically what I just covered, but maybe you can look at it and see if something kind of refreshes your memory, okay? All right, you take care now, and I'll be in touch soon.